In this question, first of all, we need to investigate whether system of the blocks A and B moves together with the common acceleration or there is relative sliding between the blocks. In case of the relative sliding, acceleration of the block A and B will be different. First assume system moves together. For this common acceleration should be equal to applied force F divided by total mass of the system MA plus MB. Capital F equal to 10 Newton. This is 10 divided by total mass 2 plus 4 that is equal to 6. That means this common acceleration is equal to 5 by 3 meter per second square. Now let us draw the free body diagrams of the blocks. This is the block A. In block A, external applied force is capital F in the forward direction. Weight in the downward direction. This is MAG. Normal reaction on A in the upward direction and friction force which is responsible for opposing the relative sliding will act in the backward direction. Now let us consider block B. Friction force on block B will act in the forward direction and this friction force on B will be responsible for motion of the block B. We can find the maximum possible value of the friction force that is called the limiting friction. So we can write F max equal to mu times normal reaction between the blocks. This normal reaction is equal to mag. So this is equal to mu multiplied by mag. Now we can find the maximum possible acceleration of the block B. Maximum possible acceleration of the block B should be equal to applied force which is responsible for the motion of the block B that is F max divided by mass of the block B that is mb. So this is equal to mu multiplied by mag divided by mb. And we know mu is equal to 0 0.4. So this is 0 0.4 multiplied by m is equal to 2. g we have taken 10. mb is equal to 4. If we calculate this is equal to 2 meter per second square. And we can observe this maximum possible acceleration of log b is greater than the assumed acceleration in the case system moves together a is equal to 5 by 3 that means we can write a is less than a max now we can say our system will move together and this friction will be static in nature it means common acceleration of the system should be equal to 5 by 3 meter per second square that means option 4 should be the correct option that means both the blocks move together with the common acceleration 5 by 3 meter per second square